All right, hello, you guys. So this reading will be for Virgo, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Okay, Virgo, we're gonna see the current energy. All right, Virgo. Let's get it started. Let's get this show on the road, Virgo. Virgo. Virgo, it feels like I haven't talked to you guys in forever, Virgo. Okay, but we're going to see. We're going to see what's going on, okay? Between you and your person, Virgo, let's see what's going on. What's tea? Y'all, I thought it was like a little weed, but but I guess not. All right, you guys. Virgo, let's pull out a card first. Virgo, sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. Okay. Virgo, look, we have here, this could be the one. Everything that you need. Okay, Virgo. Hmm. Who is this showing up and showing out for you, Virgo? You got someone thinking that that can be the one. This is, so this person, you feel like this person is perfect. This could be the one. There, there could be someone that has genuine feelings for you. Like, they have good energy. Like, period, point blank. So tell me more about this could be the one for Virgo. Clarify this could be the one for Virgo. Clarify this could be the one for Virgo. We have here, I don't know how to tell you I want to let go. Not happy. So this person that you're dealing with, Virgo, um, you you two may not be on talking terms right now, but what I'm seeing is that this person is missing you. That's what's going on. For some of you guys, you could you could already met the one that you seek already. You you could already met your soulmate or the next person you're going to be in a relationship with. But this person is dealing with someone else on the side. Like I'm seeing that this person has someone else, but they really want to be with you. That's what I'm saying, Virgo. You got somebody who really wants to be with you desperately. Mm. Yeah, look what we have here. We have new beginnings. Okay, Virgo, you cannot make this up at all. What is this? Let's hold on. Let's see how this person feel about you, Virgo. How does this person feel about Virgo? Sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. So this person, they're, they're definitely not happy that you're with someone else or you're dating someone else. They're not happy about this. That's what I'm saying. Judgment. So you could be dealing with a Scorpio here. This definitely a Scorpio that you're dealing with. This could be a Scorpio moon, Venus arising. They feel like you don't even know what you want, Virgo. That's what I'm feeling. Give me another card on how this person feel about Virgo right now. Give me another card on how this person feel about Virgo. We have here the star. So this person feel like you're their wish, they hope, they dream. Y'all, Virgo, you cannot make this up, baby. It's right here. It's clear as day. Right here. You got the camera rocking back and forth. This person, is they look at you as wish fulfillment. So this person may tell you this, like, deep down inside, they wishing that they could be with you, be with you but they could be, be with this other person. Yes. This person definitely want to reconcile with you. They just don't know how to. Cancer Scorpio Pisces energy. They want this fresh new start with you. And look, look, look what's right here. The fool. 
Virgo, you cannot make this up at all. Like, what? Tell me more about this for Virgo. Tell me what's coming up for Virgo. Tell me what's coming up for Virgo. Okay. Okay. We have here um the lover. So someone you have harmony with, like this person could be younger than you. That's what I'm saying, Virgo. Or you could be um older than this person. Well, I just said it. You could be the one that's young and this person is older by a couple years. I'm saying like six years. Some of you guys could be dealing with the person six years, six months apart. It's it's like an age gap, y'all. Doesn't have to be Virgo. You know who you're dealing with, okay? This person feel like they have this strong connection with you to the point they want to let this other person go. They don't want this other person. They All they want is you. Who's seen that song? All I want is you. I'm going to listen to that song. Now, all I want is you now. Now that you're gone. This is what I'm hearing, you guys. Who's seen that? I think it's Miguel, y'all. Last, last read, I got the song wrong. I, I'm over here talking about some Kelly Rowland scene, Tell Me The Truth. It's really Carrie Hilson, so I was wrong that, y'all. I was cracking up in y'all in the comments on that last read. So, <laughs> Virgo, if you haven't looked at the last reading, go look at that last reading. Oh, my goodness. Like, it is so funny because... I was thinking about a song. I thought Kelly Rowland sung that song, but it was really Ke Carrie Hilson. Tell me the truth. That is so funny, y'all. But, um, yeah. What I'm hearing, like, is... Back to the reading. What I'm hearing is, All I want is you now. I believe it's Miguel. Now that you're going. This is how this person is feeling. OMG. Whatever they did to you, whatever, you know, they regret. They 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 feel like they should have chose you. You know, they want to talk to you. They want to see how your day been. How's your they just want to know about you, Virgo. That's what I'm hearing. Like, I just want to know about Virgo. What's what Virgo up to? What is Virgo doing? I just want to talk to Virgo. I want to speak to Virgo. This person wants to grow with you. This person wants to grow and expand. Look, we have the six of swords. Yeah. So you could be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy, or this could be a Gemini, Moon, Venus, arising. I mean, like air sign placements. This person could have a lot of air sign placement. I'm saying Pisces here as well. Look, we have the star here, six of swords. So you you may not know this, Virgo, but this person is feeling sad and they have to move on from you, okay? They have to move, move on. This is what they feeling. And they also feel like you got somebody else. There's someone else. Y'all, these, there were just three cards. So we're going to pull out one card. I hate when, like, multiple cards come out because it's just like, now you confusing me, period, point blank. One card at a time so I can see what's going on. Period. Point blank. Nobody got time for that. Clarify the Six of Swords. We have the Five of Cups. Yeah. Like, didn't I tell you that this person is sad without you? This talks about regret. Five, five of Cups. So, this, this person is regretting. Like I said, if this person chose another person over you, Virgo, they regret that. And what else I'm, I'm seeing, Virgo, they feeling like they're, they're sad. All I want, look, I'm going to just grab these two little cards right here, even though I said one. Yeah, they wanted, the secret is they wanted to continue to try. They wanted to continue to, to invest in this connection. That's what I'm saying, y'all. You cannot make this up. It's here as clear as day. That's the secret. And this person, they're not telling you this, y'all. This is the current energy, Virgo. You cannot make this up. They're not telling you that they want to be with you. They're not telling you that they want to expand with you. Some of you guys, you could already know this, okay?
This could be a Leo. You could be dealing with a Leo as well. Pisces here. All I want is you. Now, I'm saying like this person thinks about you a lot. Like you probably think that this person, like this is like a water sign, fire sign, air sign, um, missing you and you feel like they moving on from you, Virgo. They're not. They're not moving on at all. They at home. They worried about you. They sad. This is them. They upset that they have to move on. They feel like, you know, they have to move on from you because they feel like you got somebody else or they feel like this connection over, like you really don't want them, Virgo. Okay, let's see. Let's see what's going on. What would be the outcome of this? Okay. The key one, so you two are going to come back together. You're going to let this person come back in your house and get your goods, have sex with you good, fuck you good. Cause baby, this is what I'm saying. They're they the king of wands. Baby, I ask what's the outcome. We get the king of wands. You cannot make this up, y'all. You're going to be making love to this person. Y'all, you, you probably like, oh, I'm never going to deal with them again. Virgo, yes, you are, baby. You got the king of wands. Like, they, they, they the king. They not even the knight. <laughs> they the king, baby. Tell me more about this outcome. Like, you two going to come back together? Care about the king of wands. The outcome for Virgo and this person. Like, if you're a male, Virgo, you're going to come back to this woman. Y'all, look. It's a friend. That's a fresh new start. Taking a leap of faith. This connection is definitely not over with. You know, you two gonna make y'all y'all gonna find a way to come together. Okay, that's what I'm saying, Virgo. Look, it's gonna be a celebration. I'm saying that you coming to this person house or home, or they're coming to your house or home. I'm saying like drinks. You guys could love to drink, smoke, whatever y'all like to do or get down. I'm saying all that is happening, y'all. You cannot make this up, Virgo. All right, Virgo, this is the only thing I have for you. Please like, subscribe, and share, and let me know what's going down in the comments. All right, baby? All right, y'all. Thank you. Peace out.